Uh, it's never too early to start a side hustle. A local middle school student is earning a little extra cash in quarantine with some neat handmade jewelry. Yes, Lori Wallace is live with why this is such a wonderful learning experience. Hey, Lori. Hey, good morning. Yes, Bee's Bracelet Boutique. So Bella here is 13 years old. She just happens to be the president at Chilton Middle School. Oh, fabulous. Code. So uh -huh. she knows someone you know. Mm -hmm. And not only that, but you went and spoke to her class last year. I did. So there you go. Yes, I'm sure you taught her all kinds of wonderful things. So we'll hear about that in just a little bit. But first, we'll get to the bracelet. So Bella, this is what you decided to do. Stuck at home over the summer, your family typically would be out of town, but you guys obviously are here. Yeah, so it's been super fun. I make bracelets because like I have a ton of free time. And so it's taught me a lot about time management, like marketing and web design, which has been super fun. And it's really, yeah, it's really interesting to learn. Yeah, and this really took off, which you weren't expecting for people to catch on to this yeah. as quickly as they did. So talk a little bit about your experience as you got started. Um, well, I learned like how you have to always like keep posting stuff and you have to keep people interested in your business. And so it's been tricky at times about like trying to keep up with everything, but it gets it's super fun. That social media engagement is everything, guys. Okay, so now that Bella's off and running, uh, the whole reason behind this, why she started it, she wanted to save enough money to buy a car. So what are you saving up to buy? I'm saving up to buy a Jeep Wrangler for my first car, which is like my dream car. And you're, you got a couple years so you can actually drive? Yeah, I have two years. Okay, in addition to that, you've also been collecting for charities. Talk about what charity you've been wanting to help and why. Um, so I donated to the Juvenile Diabetes Research Foundation, which I, want, I chose that charity because my dad has diabetes, so I wanted to give back to that. Okay, so let's get a look at these bracelets. Kind of explain what they look like, what you do to put these together. Um, so these are like the original bracelets. They are adjustable, and there's so, the, a ton of different colors. These are our collection, so there's a pack of three bracelets. They range from like $14 to $19, and this is like just how we package our bracelets. So, Coates, when you visited her school, you taught her the who, what, when, where, why. I think she did a pretty darn good I job. Think she did. So, yeah. good job to you. <laughs> and and if, if you didn't love her enough already, and mom's not going to love this because she doesn't want to be on TV, told her she doesn't have to talk, but the shirt... She's wearing her What Would Dolly Do shirt, Cody. Oh, how I mean, it's like you guys were just meant to be. I know. We're just besties. <laughs> I'm just meant to be. All right, Bella, where can people find information on where they can get these bracelets? Um, so I'm on Instagram, Facebook, and my website, thesebraceboutique.com. Well, good for you. And what a great way to make use of your time over the summer. Super cute bracelets. And get this girl that Jeep Wrangler. I mean, <laughs> oh, she's who well doesn't want a Jeep Wrangler when they learn how to drive? <laughs> Back to you guys.